The other free option we want to get into is that free 30 day trial. So now I'm going to go to the QuickBooks icon up top. And usually uh, what they're advertising in here will be the online version. That's the one that they're focused on. But I like to go all the way to the bottom. And for some reason, their sales page is a little bit different. If I go to my products down here and they've had this item at the bottom for some time, it's like it's looked very similar for some time. And then in the products, I want to go to QuickBooks Online so I can zero in on the product I'm focused in. And then note here, it has has try it for free 30 days. So you got the 30 day trial here. If I scroll down, here's your options. Here's the toggle that I'm used to seeing. They've had that for some time. Note on the prior page, it wasn't there, the toggle. And they might change this. Their web page has been changing over time. So they might try to remove this little toggle at some point, at which time you might just search into your search engine. I think it would be easier to find the free trial possibly even outside of the Intuit website, just typing in QuickBooks Online free trial and, and you might and then look for the Intuit website. Now it's a little bit scary to set up the free trial because when I toggle to the right, then the prices jump up. So that's what I'm talking about by using the free trial as a practice file because QuickBooks is saying, hey, look, if you take the 30 day free trial, it's going to cost you more after you start after you start rolling forward. But my plan is that I'm going to I'm going to use the free trial to practice with the to see if I want it, if I like it. And then I'm going to possibly set up another company file, possibly with uh, the, the help of an, an, an accountant to get a discount or me or something like that when I set up the company file. So I'm not going to be too frightened by the fact that the plot the price jumped up here because i'm gonna i'm gonna cancel it before the 30 days is up is the plan all right so i'm gonna i'm gonna go over here and then i'm gonna use the plus version you could practice with the simple start or the essentials you can look at the differences the differences are highlighted uh in bold down below you can connect three sales channels that's one of the newer newer kind of things we might have a whole section on that we get into that later so include three users that's one of the major uh, differences and over here you got five users and then inventory is one of the big differences to get up to the plus but the plus is kind of like the default it, used, it was kind of the one that that most people were using so when we use the, the free trial i'm going to use the plus and we'll talk a little bit about that inventory if you don't have inventory then you might not need the plus uh, but it'll all of them will look in essence the same uh, except that the ad the higher ones will have some options that the lower ones do not clearly so uh so the difference between desktop and online is quite different they're like totally different softwares the difference between simple start uh essentials plus and advanced is kind of like the same software but they turn on more features right so it's pretty much the same stuff all right so i'm going to choose this one and so then uh continue so then they also have the payroll option so i think you can get a free 30-day trial for the payroll as well but we shouldn't need payroll in this practice problem so i'm not going to turn it on but i think if you wanted to practice with the payroll you want to make sure to turn it off but before the, the end of the time frame you might be able to look into the 30-day trial with the payroll but i'm just going to continue here and so now we've got your total uh, your total after after 30 days is $85. Again, they're trying to scare us with the 85, but I'm going to cancel it before the 30 days, hopefully. And so your plan here, it says free trial for 30 days. And so I'm going to say, all right, that's good to go. Good to go on that. Now, if you already have an account, then you could give them the account and you should still, even if you have an account, possibly be able to get the 30 day trial because you're setting up another, a different you know company file. Uh, and if you don't have if you don't have an Intuit account, then you can of course set up your Intuit account here. So it may require the payment options here. So again, if you put in the payment options, you got to make sure that you uh, stop it <laughs> before the uh, before the end of the 30 days. For the company address, I'm just going to pick an address from a Beverly Hills 85 million dollar home here. One two one zero Benedict canyon drive and this is going to be a 90210 beverly hills beverly hills oh, hold on a second populated already bever beverly hills california boom 
and then OK and continue. So then it's going to try to scare you again because it's saying, hey, we're giving you you're going to get charged way more after the 30 days. And so they you got the green buttons to buy it or continue with the little button down here that they're trying to hide at the bottom. But we're going to continue because we're going to cancel before the 30 days is up. Hopefully that's the plan. That's the plan. So I'm going to go into the to the continue. 